Known as the city of bridges, Pittsburgh is surrounded by mountains, bridges and rivers. Rich in history, culture and sports, it has some beautiful museums, stadiums, art centers and a very happening shopping district with several great dining and shopping options. Hi, I am Sudeepa. We are at Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania to spend the Easter weekend at our friend's house and excited to explore the city. Covering everything in three days is not possible, but we are trying to make the most of it by visiting the unmissable spots. Like many other eastern cities, Pittsburgh is most enjoyable during spring and fall. So Easter long weekend is just perfect. The six hours long drive from New Jersey to Berg is as beautiful as the destination. You cross some beautiful villages, mountains and tunnels on your way. This time we are staying at our friend's house and getting pampered by some home cooked meals. But popular neighborhoods with hotels include downtown Pittsburgh, the north side, Lawrenceville, the Strip District and East Liberty. A ride on the iconic Duquesne Incline is a must for any trip to Pittsburgh. Take the car to the top of the observation deck to see one of the best views of the city. Tickets are $5 round trip for the adults and $2.5 for the kids. You need to keep exact change and cash. They don't accept cards. Children under 5 are free. This is open 365 days a year and run approximately every 5 minutes. The city view from the top is incredible. This is described as one of the 10 top most beautiful views in America by USA Today magazine for a reason. You can also explore the museum while waiting for the car and get to know more about Pittsburgh's history. Located in the heart of Mexican Wall Street's neighborhood, Randyland is a beautiful open-air museum. In 
In 1995, artist Randy Gilson purchased a few rundown buildings and started turning them into an incredible art center by using paints, plants, plastic animals, yard cell finds, and discarded construction materials. Randy Land is absolutely free to visit, but donations are accepted. The historic Strip District is one of Pittsburgh's most fascinating experiences which you cannot miss. The Strip District is located just outside of downtown Pittsburgh on the banks of Allegheny River. This is an outdoor marketplace of shops, restaurants, old-style ethnic grocers, gourmet food shops and much more. There are so many great places to eat, drink and shop here. Browsing through the countless ethnic and produce markets and specialty shops is something we really enjoy. A trip to the strip is incomplete without trying the famous Primanti Bros handcrafted sandwiches. They have many locations but this one is the most popular one. The terminal is an extension of the strip district. This iconic five block long building is a vibrant neighborhood bustling with cute cafes, shops, eateries with beautiful outdoor seating. This part is little less crowded than the main strip area and super cool to hang out. Caliban Bookshop is a hidden gem and book lovers paradise in Pittsburgh. This is a used bookshop with a lovely curated collection of used and rare books. During our stay, we also visited the Sri Venkateshwara Temple. This is an Hindu temple in Penn Hills, Pittsburgh. It is one of the earliest traditional Hindu temples built in 1976 in the USA and a very popular one. 